All right, all right, all right. Yo, what up, everyone? Welcome back. It's been a minute since we've done a video like this. Um, so, so hello. Uh, <laughs> it's it's been a while. Uh, so today, guys, um, we're live here on uh, on on the Facebook channel. Um, on the Facebook page for the channel, uh, link to the YouTube is, uh, should be right underneath you, uh, while you're watching this, but, um, but yeah, I bought a bunch of Pokemon cards today. Like, a lot of Pokemon cards. Like, like, more than I bought in a while, and I didn't want to do just a video or anything for these, because I probably won't get edited and probably wouldn't get out anytime soon. And so... I wanted to do this live and uh, just kind of vibe with you guys. Let's let's vibe and uh, and open some Pokemon cards. Uh, but let me run down what we got here because uh, there's a lot. Uh, so as as you guys probably know, if you're watching this, um, Astral Radiance just uh, released today. Um, it is the official U.S. release date of Astral Radiance, which is the new uh, Pokemon Sword and Shield set for the cards. So we picked up the um, Eevee and Coin, uh, the promo three-pack collection, right? So we got three three Astro Radiance here, um, and then we have that's not all the Astro Radiance we have. We have we have a lot more. Uh, we have this that also came out today, uh, the Cleavor V Star box. So we're gonna get into that, and of course, the best piece of Pokemon material from this set, the Dark Rai themed Elite Trainer box. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I think this is one of the coolest Elite Trainer boxes we've had in years. Um, yes, Dark Rai's in the set, but he's not like the main focal point, and I think it's cool that they themed the whole thing after Dark Rai, even though he's not like the main focal point in the set. It's the uh, Origin Forum Dialga and Palkia that are. But definitely cool uh, there. And then to top it all off, on top of that, um, I bought another ETB from a set I haven't opened in a while, and um, there's still a few cards I want to play, and it's always a uh, few cards I want to get, and it's always fun to open them up. So I did pick up another, yet another, Shining Fates ETB. So we will be getting into that probably last. Um, as I said, it's been a while since I've gotten into Shining Fates, and I just felt like opening the set, so that's why I got that. Um, but, yeah, um, if you guys... Uh, if you guys, I guess, like, um, the, you guys watching this live, you know, if you like it, um, just, just let, let's just chat it out, but, um, I'm probably gonna up upload this to YouTube after the fact, if, uh, if it does get uploaded to YouTube, all that YouTube mumbo-jumbo, like, share, subscribe, um, yeah, uh, let, let's, just, let's just get into it, I, I don't, I don't know how else to, to drag this on any longer, so let's, <laughs> let's just flip this. Uh, let's just flip the camera. Let's get into it. All right, and get ourselves centered here. Let's get our light turned around. So I had the light facing. Um... Oh my God! It's not gonna come off. Oof. Uh... Actually, I might just flip all the way, all the way up. Thanks. There we go. I need a better lighting. <laughs> Cool, 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 cool. Awesome. All right. Very unprofessional. I know, but let's just <laughs> let's just get into it. So, what do we get into first? I'm thinking. I'm thinking we need to start it off with the ETB so we can take a look at the set list and stuff. Let's start it off with 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 the ETB. Um, usually, I like to save the best for last, but you know, I wanna I. I've seen the set list online, but I want to take a closer look because I I don't know. It was a while ago that I looked at the set list uh, back when it first got like kind of leaked and stuff. So uh, it's been been a hot second, guys. I came like super unprepared. I forgot to grab my knife uh, to cut the edge of the plastic. So now I'm looking for a random sharp object that we can use to puncture a cellophane wrap. Kids don't try this at home. We're going to use the end of a prong of a charger to puncture a cellophane. So you can get a nice, 
uh, cut in here to, to open this up. But, all right. I literally had nothing else. I was like, what the hell can I use to, to open this? All right. Oh, such a brilliant red and black color scream, color scheme. Uh, of course, we got the set list in there. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Oh my god, that is absolutely gorgeous. Let's just take a look at the top of this. Whoo! Sheesh, guys, 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 guys. If you buy anything from Astro Radiance, make it be this ETB, because look how pretty it is. Holy crap, it's gorgeous. Dark Rye, all the way. Dark Rye, all the way. Let's look, take a look at the set list. Because I'm like, like I've seen it, but I, I haven't seen it. I haven't really taken a deep dive into it, so let's, let's take a look at the set list. Uh, those of you in the chat, what's your favorite, uh, y'all, what's your favorite card from the set out of what you've seen? Or I guess when we look at the set list, you can also tell me after that, I guess. But, alright. So, our grass types, we got a drill. We got Hisuian, Hisuian, Voltorb, and Electrode. Cool. Scyther. Cricket's high. Like, likes to go out of focus every 10 seconds. A Shaman. Lilligant. Lilligant V Star. Okay. I like the artwork on that. Heat Ran. Heat Ran V Max. So, V Max and V Star are both. In this set, I actually really haven't opened much from the last two sets, so I was, I'm very new to the whole V Star thing. Um, I haven't even built a deck with a V Star yet. I kind of want that Radiant Heat Ran, because the Radiant cards are shiny Pokemon, which I think is really awesome. Oh yeah, Origin Form Palkia, and then okay. Uh, I definitely know what I want to pull, so I got we got the Ma Machamp V Max, Machamp V. Definitely want those. Definitely want that Decidueye, because he is like my favorite starter. Definitely want that Decidueye. Got to get the Dark Cry. Got to got to pull the Dark Cry. Um, Dialga, of course. Guard Chomp. Is that Reggie Drago? Really? Out of like, out of left field. Seeing Reggie drag a weird ear. Um, and then the trainers, when we get into the super arts. Now these, I mean, of course I want all of them. But, but uh, there's a few I definitely want in particular if we can get the camera to focus. So, um, of course, that is one of the chase cards right here. Let's try to zoom in. Um, the origin form Palkia. V is definitely a chase, definitely one we're going to try to go after, um, as well as the Origin Form Dialga V. This is the most expensive card in the set, um, so if we pull it, that might be attempted to sell one, I don't know. Um, I don't tend to send my sell my cards, but that might be tempting, since that's that's the one going for the, <laughs> the most money out here. Um, and then, of course, we got the uh, Character Art Gallery. Um, I definitely want the Gardevoir. And um, the Shadow Rider Calyrex and Shadow Rider Calyrex V Max that has the uh, Pro Tag from Sword and Shield. Um, I think that's really cool. Um, as well as Zashian and Zamazenta, also really cool. We got uh, uh, Hop from that's his name, right? Yeah, I think it's Hop from Sword and Shield. Um, so like your your uh, rival. Uh, but he's got Zashian and Zamazenta, and then Cynthia's Garchomp, really want that one. Um, and then, of course, we got the Secret Rare Calyrex VMAX uh, cards. So, Shadow Rider and Ice Rider. So, let's get into this, the box, let's see what the rest is in here. So, we got, as per usual, per every ETB, we got our Fat Stack of Energy, uh, the Deck Dividers, which are really nice. I'll probably actually use those because... Um, they're Dark Cry themed. Uh, V Star Marker, Poison, Damage, Burn Counters, all that kind of jazz. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight packs of Astral Radiance. Um, the Thing of Dice, which, oh wow. 
Um, I don't know how well it's going to pick up on the camera. Actually, I'll just take these out and see if it'll pick up different. This black dye is like sparkled with red and it almost looks like ruby inside of like like a black stone. I really like that a lot. These might be, these might be my favorite dice I have ever had for, for this game. Um, try to zoom in. But yeah, it's got like this crystal ruby pattern kind of in it which is really cool. So it shines in the black, and then it's got, like, the little little ruby flex in it. That's awesome. That's awesome. That's really cool. Uh, the other dice are just solid red um, with black numbers, which is pretty typical Pokemon, but what are you going to do? And then, of course, we got the Darkrai-themed sleeves. Uh, gotta love Darkrai. All the respect to Darkrai. Uh, but without further ado... Let's start to get into some packs. I'm going to shuffle them up here. Uh, really, I just want to pull Darkrai because I want to build a deck with Darkrai. So I'll uh, we'll shuffle them up. But I want to start with a Decedgy Y. So there we go. Alrighty. Ugh. What's up? We got a Scyther poking through. All right. One, two, three, four to the front. Been a favorite for years. Yeah, absolutely has been. No, yeah, D Darkrai is like... I think Darkrai was one of the first Pokemon that really got me... Um, I mean, I was into Pokemon before Darkrai came out, but Darkrai was one of the first Pokemon that I really like thought was, was awesome and really got me into Pokemon and stuff. So um, it's definitely cool to see him getting... Um, at least in cards, getting some, like, shining through, because it's been a minute since he's had any representation. You got a Lightning Energy, Curlia, Spicy Seasoned Curry, Togetic, Scyther, Togepi, Combi, Shadot, Drifloon, Vespaqueen, and a Hollow Gallade. All right, first pack is a Hollow. Very nice, very nice indeed. We're going to open up our new Hisuian Typhlosion pack. You know, Hisui and Typhlosion has definitely been growing on me um, over the time playing Legends Arceus. Like, at first, I was like, you know what? He's... I, at first, I thought he was really weak. I was like, you know, the other two um, starters got these cool new final evolutions. Like, the Sejuai came, became like a samurai, right? And he was really cool. Uh, instead of the Robin Hood look, he became, got like an old samurai look to him. Samurai got the same kind of treatment to him, which was really cool. Um, uh, one, two, three, four, and then, um, and then uh, Typhlosion, I was like, his flames are different, and I didn't really, I don't know, I didn't really like it at, at first, because, like, without his flames, he looks pretty similar, Magneton, uh, Gabe Job Bog, Yan Mega, Bronzor, Oshawott, Hoot Hoot, Cricketot, Stantler, Wait and See Turbo, and a Glaceon non-hollow. But it's Glaceon, so we'll take it. Um, but yeah, like, at first, um, yeah, I didn't really like him, but as I started to play the game more and I saw him more, um, I definitely, he's definitely grown on me. I don't know whether I still, I, I still don't know whether I place him above, like, Hisuian Samurai or Decedueye. Um, but I definitely, I definitely think he's not the worst starter of all time. Um, so, so that's, that's saying something because he was not at all my favorite. Like, I, I really didn't like him at the start. So, Psychic Energy, Suian Overquill, Jubilee Village, Noctowl, Barboach, Pawneered, EV. Oh, look at the EV art. Wait, let's go back. Look at the EV art. That's adorable. Uh, Heracross, Teddy Ursa, also adorable, Petalil, and a Rapidash, non-hollow rare. Okay, getting all the non-hollows, the, the dub pulls out of the way so that we can hit stuff at the end. I see how it is. I see how it is, Pokemon. I see how it is. Let's get into our next pack. Oh, starting off with the Psyduck. Psyduck. Three-fourths of the front. 
Man, it's been a minute since I've got this many Pokemon cards. <laughs> All right, Fighting Energy, Drift Blim, Dart Tricks, Unidentified Fossil, Psyduck. I don't like that Fossil cards are back. Petalil, Stantler, Bergmite, Hippopotas, Mischievous, and Regilecki. I really don't. What? Sorry about that. Wow. I accidentally hit my camera uh, as I was pulling the cards off to the side, and uh, and just like completely knocked everything over. But uh, but we're we're good now. We're good now. We're yeah, cool. <laughs> Whoops. Whoops. It's okay. If this gets uploaded to YouTube, if I end up uploading this to YouTube, that'll get edited out, or I'll leave it. Actually, I might leave it. It's kind of funny. <laughs> All right, one, two, three, four to the front. All right, it's foretelling something great. We're starting off with the Dark Energy. Does that mean Dark Ride? Hisumi and Overquill, Energy Lotto, Yuxi, Puchiana, Yanma. Drifloon, Pseudo Udo, Combi, Shaman Reverse, and let's go! Rainbow Rare is Suian, Lilligant, V Star. Woo! Finally a good pull. Alright. I'm gonna get this sleeved up right away. Awesome. First Rainbow Rare of the set is Suian, Lilligant, V Star. Still not sure, like, net value. I'll have to look that up after the stream. But definitely, definitely like it. I mean, it's definitely going into the the collection regardless. Wow. Awesome, awesome. We're going to put that in the back. we got three packs left uh, for the ETB. And then we'll move on to the Cleavor box. But, but I'm not, you know, I'm not, I'm not upset with this ETB so far. I mean, it didn't, um, you know, I've... I have, I tend to have bad luck with ETVs, um, if you all, like, like, follow, like, my videos, um, I tend to have really bad luck on the ETVs, but then, like, on everything else, I have pretty decent luck, um, or not luck, but, like, I, I get, I get pretty good pulls, let's say, on, um, one, two, three, four, uh, on everything else other than ETVs, like, the ETVs really, really don't like me. They, they just really don't like me. We got Grass Energy, Canceling Cologne, Curlia, Zisu, Routes, Suian Sneasel, Mistrevis, Bearboach, Scyther, Psyduck, and Regilecki. All right. Can we go four and four? Can we do 50 50 hollow or better and 50 or uh, like 50% hollow? Or better, and 50% dud. Let's see. We're down to our last two packs. Hopefully, we can get a hit on both of these. And that way, we're uh, our ratio is pretty decent. Four to the front. Starting off with a Water Energy. Oh, Shield On's a little clay creature. I love that they're doing the clay arts again. That's super cool. Shield On. Hisuian Heavy Ball. Prugly. Another Eevee. Heracross. Teddy, that looks very familiar. Mantine, Voltor. Didn't we to pull those three exactly in a row earlier? That just earlier. That's really funny. Cricketot and Thievial. non hollow rare. Alrighty. Last pack of the ETB is a Origin Form Dialga pack. This is the new form of Dialga. For those of you who haven't played Arceus yet, um, he's got his new originated god form uh very very cool uh definitely my favorite of the two i don't like that palkia becomes um a centaur i i just don't like it um i get i get it i understand the design choice from a from a lore aspect but i i don't like it i i, I just don't like the way it looks i think they could have done it better but uh but i definitely like dialga and the way dialga looks all right let's get this going all right Final pack, Metal Energy, Zisu, Curlia, uh, Canceling Cologne, Assuming Voltor, Rufflet, oh, I see something poking through, Ponita, Rowlet, Bronzor, oh, that's part of the character, wait, this is a double pull, no way, no way, 
That's a secret rare trainer. Is that from the character vault? Okay, that's from the character vault. And then... Weird Ear V. Let's go! Last pack magic for the ETB. A double hit. Let's go! We got the Melanie Full Art Trainer from the Character Vault, which takes place in the hollow, uh, like the reverse hollow um, slot for your packs. Can have one of the character art card sets, uh, cards in it. So that's basically what happened. We just got a double hit. In the pack, because we got one of the full art character arts, and we got the Weird Ear V on top of that. Definitely awesome. I'm gonna I'm gonna count it as a good box. You know what I mean? Like that was a that was a decent box. Definitely not the worst that we, that we've had um, on on the channel and on the page in the past. Like definitely not the worst. <laughs> we've had we've had much worse. Um, I've had whole boxes where I haven't pulled a single hollow, and it's crazy. So, uh, just a little rundown of that. We got the Melody, Weird Ear, uh, the Rainbow, Hisui, and Lilligan V-Star, and the Hollow Gallade. So they're going to be stick there in the back. Alrighty. Awesome. Absolutely awesome. Now for this big boy. Now, <laughs> now for the big boy, we're going to get into, um, the... Cleavor V-Star box. Um, I actually debated whether I was buying this today, but they were having a pretty decent sale at GameStop, so I ended up essentially getting this for free um, with everything else that I bought. Like, I ended up essentially getting this for free, so I was like, why not? Um, but I did debate on it, because Cleavor is not my favorite of the new like evolutions from Arceus. Um, for those of you who don't know, Cleavor is Scyther's new secondary evolution. So Scyther used to only evolve into Scizor using a metal coat, uh, but now, uh, as of we figured out, there was an ancient form of Scyther uh, or, or of Scyther who would uh, evolve using this special rock that's in Arceus called Adamantite uh, to become Cleavor, which he grows these giant axe-shaped size on his, uh, made out of rock on his, uh, on his arms instead of the metal arms, of course, that the metal coat used. So it's really cool, um, but it's cool, but he's not my favorite. Uh, but let's get into here. We got the, uh, Cleavor V-Star Jumbo card that comes with this. This was really the, 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 the trigger for me, is we got a Cleavor pin, which I think is awesome, because I love pins. I'm a sucker for pins. Cleavor pin looks really cool. I like his little pose that he's, that he's doing. I like it a lot. Uh, <laughs> and then, for me, it's tied between Hisui and Lilligan. Hisui and Zoroark, absolutely. I don't like Hisui and Lilligan that much. For me, I would say my favorite Hisuian forms, uh, definitely, Zor uh, definitely Zoroark. Um, and Arcanine. I really like Zoroark and Arcanine's uh, Hisuian forms. I definitely thought they were really cool. If we're not counting the starters. If we're counting the Star Wars, it's Decedui and Zoroark. Because I really like Decedui. Um, also, and then let me pull out the promo cards to show those off. And we'll get those sleeved up. Because they are um, full arts. Which is which is pretty nice. So we'll, we'll definitely have to get these sleeved up. I'm putting these in my Arceus sleeves. I'm not using my Arceus sleeves for uh, for decks just because they have this cool gold backing, and I like to keep my collection stuff in them. Uh, I might have to buy another Brilliant Stars ETB at some point to get more of these Arceus sleeves just because they look really cool to put your cards in uh, with the gold foil backing. Uh, so we're gonna we're gonna sleeve these up real quick and then I'll show them off. All right, so we got right off the bat we get a full art. Cleavor V, uh, so you can use it, and then we get the Cleavor V Star right off the bat also. So, those are already guaranteed pulls in this box, regardless of anything else that you do, you are guaranteed those, which is kind of nice, and you also get this Jumbo Cleavor Flip Coin, which is pretty cool. Alright. Oh my god, all the cards are falling over in the back. It's fine, we'll leave them there. Um, and then it comes with six packs assorted from the last three sets. So we got two Astral Radiance, we got two uh, two Brilliant Stars, and two Fusion Strikes. So we're going to start oldest 
Uh, two newest, and we're going to end with, of course, Astral Radiance for this. Uh, so we're going to start with Fusion Strike. I still have a couple things I'm trying to pull out of Fusion Strike, so um, it's a good thing we're doing this. I've opened a full booster box of Fusion Strike, so I have quite a bit of this set already, but there are a few hits that we still haven't gotten, so let's get into it. Let's see what's next. We have Fighting Energy, Heliosk, Sharpedo, Quick Ball, love the Quick Ball, Minoon, Ball Toy, Galarian Corsola, Quillfish, Vulpix, Skarmory, and a Hollow Landorus. All right, first Hollow. Not bad, not bad, not great, but not bad, not bad at all. All right, let's get into um, our other Fusion Strike pack here. It is a Gengar VMAX pack, but not that that really matters, but hey, why not? I'd actually kind of like to pull the Gengar. Um, that is on my list of stuff I'd like to pull. One, two, three, four, to the front. We got Fire Energy, Nine Tails, Farewell Bell, Low Punny. I won't even talk about how inappropriate that is. Grubbin, Rotom, Smeargle, Caravana, Clamp Pearl, Clodzer. All right, and the Tyranitar V, not too bad. Both technically hits out of Fusion Strike. Both uh, two for we're two for two on the Fusion Strike packs, which is which is not bad. I, I can't I cannot complain. That is actually that's fairly decent. Um, it makes me worry though about the rest of the cards we're gonna pull out of the other sets because uh, if we just pulled that out of that, then. Ugh, that, that makes me worry a little bit, but look, we'll get into it. Brilliant Stars will open the uh, Cottony pack first. Alright. Oh, this feels super light. Why does this feel super light? <laughs> why, why does this pack feel ultra light? Like, one, two, three, four, to the front. Like, it feels way lighter than the others. I don't know why. Alright. Dark Energy, Dust Collapse, Gloria, Inferno... Stargu, Impidimp, Burmy, Spiritomb, Magmar, Mewtwo Reverse, and Wormadam. You know, I'll take that Mewtwo Reverse. I'll take that Mewtwo Reverse. That is a nice card. That is a very nice card. I like the way it looks. We'll take it. Get into our other Brilliant Stars. When's the last time I ate? Why ask that question? Like, 15 minutes ago? Not even. One, two, three, four. To the front. Alright, we got a Psychic Energy, Team Yells Cheer, Probe Pass, Friends and Galar, Shy Mago, Electabuzz, Bidoof, Sneasel, Grimer, Wormadam, and a Hollow Infernape. Not too bad. Three of her packs have had at least a Hollow or better. That is not too shabby. That is not too bad. We're doing pretty good, guys. We're doing pretty good. Pretty solid. We're going to finally get into our Astral Radiance packs. The first official, like, Legends Arceus-themed set. Legend. Why? Why did this happen? Look at this. The pull tab did not work. <laughs> it just was like, I give up. I give up. I'm not working today. I don't want to work today. This is literally what it said. One, two, three, four to the front. We have a metal energy. Oh, oh. Are we going to. Okay. Energy Lotto. Hisuian Overquill. Kamado. Bergmite, Hippopotas, Cinequil, Pawneard, Sui and Growlithe, Sui and Arcanine, and a Cleavor. Well, I mean, you know what? We'll put him in with the Cleavor collection that we all of a sudden have. Okay. Last pack of the Cleavor box um, is my boy, Decidueye. Hisui and Decidueye, to be exact. My name's Decidueye. Hisui and Decidueye. Um, anyway. 
Uh, he is the last pack of the Cleavor box. We got one, two, three, four to the front. I feel like this always happens to me with the, these day one, like, specialty boxes that they make. Like, the rest of the packs have decent stuff in them. Like, okay bulls. But the actual new set doesn't have anything. Dark Energy, Jubilife Village... Kulaba, Dark Patch, Cyndaquil, Suing Quillfish, Hippopotas, Cyndaquil again, Ponyard, Nickit, and a Reggie Ilecki. Alrighty, not too bad, but like, as, overall the box was not that bad. Overall the box was pretty fair. Um, however, I do feel like I, I don't know if this is a thing, but I feel like every time I do open these boxes that release day one of the sets, um, that we usually pull, I usually pull, like, good things out of the past packs, like, from the past set, but then don't pull anything from the actual new set, um, that tends to be a trend that I have noticed, I don't know whether it's actually a thing or not, if that's on purpose, but, I, yeah, I don't know, we'll see. Uh, we are gonna get in to, you know what, I'll save these for last, we'll, we'll end this off, since this is an Astro Radiance unboxing, we will save the a last three Astro Radiance packs for last, um, I do have that, our other box we have today, um, is a bit of a flashback, um, but I haven't opened any Shining Fates in a while, so I did buy a Shining Fates ETB, um, at my local GameStop, so we're gonna do another Shining Fates ETB, uh, because there's still quite a bit I want to pull from this set, including, of course, I would love to have that shiny Charizard VMAX. Um, that would be, that would be absolutely amazing, but we're going to kind of go through this. I'm not going to really show what's in this box. I think we all know at this point what's in this box. Uh, we've opened them enough times now. I think this is like my fifth or sixth one of these. Um... <laughs> It's just the best way to buy Shining Fates packs. Um, it is the most cost-affordive uh, and best way to buy Shining Fates packs. So if you're going to buy Shining Fates, you might as well buy an ETB. Um, but it is, uh, you know, uh, it's, you know, what it is, <laughs> I guess, is, is how I'll put it. But, you know, as per usual, uh, I, I guess if anyone wants this, uh, let me know. Uh, either message me direct, like, uh, message, comment on this video, um, if you want the EV VMAX promo, if you don't have it, or for some reason if you want it, you can have it, um, I have quite a few at this point, and I, I, I don't really need another, but we got, uh, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten Shining Fates packs here, let's get into them, I'm gonna shuffle these boys up. We're going to end with a Charizard pack. We're going to start with a Drag Bolt pack. Alright. Let's get into it. Oh, that's a good sign. One, two, three, four to the front. Oh, wait, they're, they're all white codes. I forgot. This set has all white codes, but there's something in the back. Anyway. Dark Energy. Floatzel. Luxio, Rusted Sword, Cacnea, Chewdle, Eevee, Nickit, Horsey, Rotom, and god darn it, yeah, a Rainbow Rare Al Creamy VMAX. <laughs> that is like the least valuable, the least valued Rainbow Rare in this entire set. I think I have four of these. Um... Yeah, anyway, that's, that's, you know what, I'll take it, it's a pull, I guess, um, <laughs> makes me feel a little bit better about myself, uh, <laughs> I, I was, I, I was bound to pull one of those during this box opening, um, it was, it's, you pretty much get one every box, honestly, is what it feels like, uh, Psychic Energy, Thwacky, Rusted Shield, Rotom, Coughing, Nicket, Eevee, Gossiflor, Chewdle, Shinx, 
Delmize V. Nice. That's actually a decent pull. They got, got a, a Delmize V. Not decent, but but still, like, okay. It's an okay pull. All right. Next up. Next pack. Next time on Pokemon. One, two, three. Flaw to the front. Water Energy, Gym Trainer, Rusted Shield, Dartrix, Horsey, Grookey, Morbego, Spinarak, Weasel, Horsey, Ditto VMAX, pull every pack, let's go, Ditto, let's go Ditto, Ditto my boy, let's go. The set makes you feel good about yourself. There's like a pull every pack. Even if they're not great pulls, there's pretty much a pull every pack. And it just makes you feel good. Well, Ash turn 11? No! <laughs> no, he won't. But he's in the top five trainers ever. That's that's nice. That's cool. Uh, one, two, three, four. Choose it. Farant. Fire. Energy. The Wacky. Rusted Shield, Rotom, Yanma, Chewdle, Morpico, Eevee, Gasifleur, Kafant, and our first dud pack of the box, a Manaphy. But that Manaphy is very good in deck building, so I am not mad because that is a very good card to have for building decks. Our first Charizard back! I think our first Charizard back. We might have had one more. First one I've noticed is Charizard. No, that looks like our first... First Charizard. Yeah. Might be our first Charizard. May or not, may not be the first Charizard pack. Let's see if that's got anything in it. One, two, three, four, two is the front. Alrighty. Lightning Energy, Rusted Sword, Dartrix, Ball Guy, Kafant, Buizel, Spinneret, Shinx, Coffee. Rusted Sword, and Zeru. Nothing. <laughs> uh, don't you have a Manaphy in your water deck? Yes, I do. <laughs> Absolutely I do, because it is a fantastic card. Like, I, you see, I'm not mad about any pulls because, like, cards are cards, and I can, I can use them to build decks. I, honestly, at this point with Shining Fates, though, I have... Probably 85% of the set, so it is, like, I'm most of it's all repeats. Dark Energy, Tropius, Rodom, at least for me. Rusted Shield, Yanma, Trap Bench, Rowlet, Shinx, oh, Eevee, and another Shinx, and Zarud. We're just getting all the bad stuff out of the way, guys. We're getting all the, we're getting all the crap out of the way so that we can get something good. We got four more Shining Fates packs. I believe in all of these. I believe in all of them. I be I be I can't speak. I believe in all of them. I believe in all of these packs. I believe in you guys. You will not let me down. One, two, three, four, two, the front. You will not let me down, Shining Fates. You never have. And you won't start today. Grass Energy. Thwacky. Rusted Sword. Rotom. Yanma. Buizel. Trapinch. Nick it, Gossifleur, let's go! Re Ooh, amazing rare Kyogre, and a Decedui Hollow. I'll take that amazing rare Kyogre, though, because that is a great, also great card for deck making, and I've been actually wanting another one, so I will take it happily and proudly. I will take that, radi that Radiant Rare, or Amazing Rare Kyogre. Thank you very much, Shining Fates. Thank you for that card. One, two, three, four to the front. <laughs> Alright. Uh, Metal Energy. Flacky. Tropius. Rotom. Eevee. Morpico. Buizel. Nickit. Cacnea. Indeedy. And Volcanion. Alright, last two packs. Of Shining Fates. Woo! Getting kind of hot in here. So much Pokemon unboxing. 
It really makes you work up a sweat. Woof! Okay. One, two, three, four, to the front. We have ourselves Metal Energy, Floatzel, Dartrix, Kramer. Why haven't I not gotten a shiny yet? Bweezel, Nick, Cacnea, Kufant, Eevee, Thievul, and Dreadnought. Wow! Not a single shiny vault card yet. That's impressive. That is impressive for this. Because I, like, usually I pull two or three per EZB. Like, even if I don't pull anything else, there's usually two or three shiny vaults. Like, that's impressive. Ocean Arceus and SM TGE story of Lord Ark and I made me tear up. Yeah, no, that was a really good story. All right, one, two, three, four to the front. This is the last pack of shiny face. Last pack magic for the box. Last pack magic. Let's see it. Let's see it happen. Lightning energy. Crammer at my boy. Team Yelto. Thwaggy. Yanma. Snom. I just want a shiny vault. Kufant, Grookey, Buizel, not no shiny vault, and a Yad Mega, non holo rare. Well, I will go down and say, from my knowledge, that is the that was the worst ETB for shiny face we've opened. But it wasn't horrible. I won't say it was horrible because we did pull a couple things. Okay, we did get these. I uh, got the All Karimi V Max, Delmice, Ditto V Max, and the Kyogre. Um, which is fine, but I will say it was the weakest one we've opened so far. Not trying to be a Debbie Downer, but, but, but it's fine. But it's fine. It's fine. We can have some redemption for this unboxing, because, guys, this is the last bit of the cards I have for today. We have our last three packs of Astral Radiance. That's all that really matters for today. But before we open that up, I do want to show off, um, uh, do a little promotion for, I guess... I don't know, for some reason, but I bought all of these cards at GameStop. Now, they will not be, they do, they do not sponsor me. They never will, probably will sponsor me, but I did buy all of my cards at GameStop today. And if you buy any cards, uh, Pokemon cards at GameStop this week, you do get this promo card here of Hisuian Typhlosion. And it is a very nice looking card, as well as its ability is pretty decent. Um, when going into other psychic decks in this set. So um, I definitely recommend if you're going to pick any uh, cards up from this set um, in this week, whether it's a pack or two or three, definitely pick them up from GameStop and ask them if they have these promo cards. Make sure to get these promo cards because they are very nice. So without that, with that being said, guys, just make sure to get your promo cards. Let's open up our last bit of astral radiance i hope y'all have enjoyed this those of you who got as who came out live <laughs> sorry and my buddy's in the back playing in smite and something just happened oh. uh so we got three packs of astral radiance we got oh, oh we'll, we'll show that later all right, three packs of Astral Radiance left. Um, I hope you guys have been enjoying this. Those of you watching this live, thank you for, for hanging out. And if you're watching this on YouTube after the fact, that is if I can get it onto YouTube after the fact. I know I have some issues with that sometimes with this whole Facebook live stream thing. But um, if it goes onto YouTube after the fact, thank you all for watching this till the end. And be sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you're new, and turn on the bell notifications for more Pokemon card and Kingdom Hearts content. That is kind of my focus on the channel. Um, I do a lot of Kingdom Hearts content, um, mostly live streams right now, but I do plan on doing some more Kingdom Hearts content in the future, as well as Pokemon card unboxings and maybe some other Pokemon video game related stuff in the future. Anyways, uh, here's the Eevee. Very cute Eevee. Uh, playing with a little ball, and there's some presents in the back. It seems like it's Eevee's birthday, so that's really cute. Uh, happy birthday, Eevee. Happy birthday, Eevee. Happy birthday, Eevee. Which way should we do this? We got... Hmm. I'll do it this way. I'll do it this way. All right, first pack. First pack, can we do it? First pack, let's go. One, two, three, four, to the front. Happy birthday, Eevee. Metal energy. Uh, canceling cologne. Pedal swine. 
Gardenia's v- blah, Gardenia's Vigor. Cr- Cricketot. Sudowoodo looking great. Combi. Drifloon. Psyduck. I've been doing this so long I can not form sentences. Energy Lotto. Oh, and a cute little shaman. You're a cute little shaman, guys. Shaman's so adorable. That's very nice. And get into our second pack. Try not to really fly through these, but like, it's kind of hard when it's only three packs. Uh, it's. Alright, we're gonna go super slow these last two. They are our last two. So I'm hoping we'll get something. This one will not open. Is that a good sign? Is it like ultra sealed because there's a banger in it? Is that the. Is that why? I think it is. I think it is. One, two, three, four to the front. Let's flipper dipper around here. Alrighty. We got a fire energy. Is suing an overquill. Commodo! Commander Commodo. Noctowl. Drifloon. Yanma. No, I don't have the shuriken anymore. It wasn't actually mine. I was borrowing it. And, uh, yeah. A long story. Sudowoodo. Gumby, Routes, Cleaver, and... Alright, I'll take it because it's my boy! Uh, that works! That was actually a Decidueye back, too. That's really funny. We pulled a hollow De uh, Suey and Decidueye out of a Decidueye pack. Um, pretty dope. Pretty nice. Awesome. I'll take it. One hollow. Alright. Guys, it's all come down to this. It's all come down to this, this moment, our final moment of the night, the final countdown, I'm kidding, the final pack of all of our Astral Radiance pulls is right here, uh, I will say, it's been a it's been a tough opening today, but maybe, just maybe, Origin Form Dialga will shine some holy light on us to help us through. Well, let's get into it. Arceus, please. Arceus, please. Shine your divine Pokemon light on us. Last pack magic be with us tonight. Oh, holy art thou, Sir Arceus, God of all Pokemon. Bless us today. Psychic energy. Hip out on. Energy Lotto. Kulava. Cricketot. Psyduck. Betalil, Stantler, Bergmite, Driftblim Reverse, and a hollow weird ear. Okay, that's fine. We don't have the card. So that's okay. That's okay. Two hollows and a non hollow out of the three pack. But. You know, it's alright. This was just our first bit of Astral Radiance. Uh, this is a set I really like, so I do plan to open more uh, in the future. Um, I kind of will probably do one of these big openings uh, a month, um, I, I guess is what you can expect, is I'll probably do a big unboxing like this every month. Um, so, uh, yeah, just, just kind of look out for that, because um, we'll probably do one of these a month. Uh, it's, that's probably... That's probably what will happen financially. That's all I can afford to do, so... Uh, that's, that's probably how it'll work. Let's give a little rundown of the pulls once I can get everything situated here. Uh, we'll give a little rundown of what we've gotten today. Move everything around. Alright, give me just one second to get this all moved. Move it around. Uh, 
All right, guys. So let's give a little rundown. So, our pulls for the day. We have a hollow Gallade, hollow weird ear, hollow Hisuian Decedui, an amazing rare Kyogre, Ditto V Max, Delmize V, Alcremi V Max, Hollow Infernape, Tyranitar V, Hollow Landorus, Cleavor V Star, Cleavor Full Art, Melanie a Full Art Trainer. Weird Ear V, and a Rainbow Rare Hisuian Lilligant V Star. Guys, thank you all for coming out. As per usual, if you're watching this on YouTube after the fact, be sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you're new, and turn on the bell notifications and all of that. Also, comment down below, who is your favorite of the new origin forms of Dialga and Palkia? Do you prefer Hisuian origin form Dialga, or origin form Palkia. Leave that in the comments down below on YouTube. Um, and thank you all for watching this live on Facebook. Um, on, on the Facebook live. Guys, if you um, are watching this on YouTube, um, be sure to follow the Facebook page. Um, it is Hayon Place on Facebook to, to see these live. Um, as well as uh, follow me on Twitter and TikTok. I also do minor unboxings on TikTok. Sometimes I'll just buy a three-pack or individual packs and stuff, and I will open those up on TikTok and stuff like that, um, as well as I do other stupid, fun, trendy stuff on there. Um, I, I, you know what I mean? I try, to, I try to be a little more engaged on TikTok as much as I possibly can, but thank you all uh, for coming out, and I hope you guys have a great rest of your night. Uh, till next time, my name's Noah. This is Hayon Plays. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. <laughs> Later, guys.